April is Autism Awareness Month, but did you know the Grand Strand is considered an autism friendly vacation destination? Ian Klein spoke with the founder of Champion Autism Network, celebrating 10 years of educating and empowering people to create supportive communities for those living with autism. There's all these great organizations that support the person with autism, but we wanted to be able to have the family, the siblings, the parents come out and play and kind of create a community. And that's just what she did. Becky Large started Champion Autism Network in Surfside Beach nearly a decade ago. She says as a mother to a child on the autism spectrum, she never expected the nonprofit to impact so many families and communities. In the spring of 2018, I was pushed, what is it that you want? And I wanted this program all around the world. And so really that's, uh, that's what we're doing. In 2016, the town of Surfside Beach issued a resolution declaring it the first autism-friendly travel destination. Myrtle Beach and Horry County followed suit two years later, both partnering with CAN and making the Grand Strand an autism-friendly travel destination. Large says looking back over the last 10 years, she never imagined Champion Autism Network would become a nationwide program and believes it wouldn't have been possible without the support from the Grand Strand. Well, there's many blessings and um, although it was a difficult move, it's been nothing but amazing uh, what the community is, is accepting uh, and, and, and the life changing personally and professionally uh, experiences I've gone through it. It's been amazing. Large says one of her proudest accomplishments is getting to allow the families with autistic children to come to a place like Myrtle Beach and enjoy a vacation just like everyone else. When you have a kid, you want to be able to go to a movie, go out to a restaurant, go on vacation, you know, go to Ripley's Aquarium. Um, and you don't necessarily have that opportunity unless there are some supports and assistance. So that's what's motivating. It's a, it's a really, really special thing to know that you're making some people happy. As for the future, Large says they are creating new virtual training courses to reach more communities across the country, showing that there really is no limit to how far Champion Autism Network can go. We have recently launched the Autism Travel Club and Autism Travel Card. We can have CAN or Autism Awareness and Acceptance and Readiness here, there, and everywhere. In Myrtle Beach, Ian Klein, WMBF News. This weekend, Champion Autism Network is hosting a meet and greet with two-time world's strongest man, Tom Stoltman, who was diagnosed with autism at an early age. The event Sunday afternoon at Wild Wing Cafe beginning at 3.